Ever wondered how to make the perfect apple cake at home? Well, you're in the right place. Today, we're diving into the delightful world of baking as we explore how to create a scrumptious apple cake. We'll be using simple ingredients, most of which you probably already have in your kitchen. Think fresh apples, a dash of cinnamon, a sprinkle of sugar, and a few other pantry staples. By the end of this video, you'll have the perfect recipe to impress your friends and family with a delicious homemade apple cake. First things first, gather all the ingredients you need. Let's start with the star of the show, two large ripe apples. Their natural sweetness and juicy texture are key to this cake's delicious charm. Then we need two cups of all-purpose flour, the canvas on which we paint our flavorful masterpiece. One and a half cups of granulated sugar will add the perfect sweet note, while half a cup of vegetable oil will ensure our cake is moist and soft. Don't forget the leavening agents, two teaspoons each of baking powder and baking soda to give our apple cake that lovely rise. For that warm, comforting flavor, we'll need a teaspoon of ground cinnamon. And of course, we need three large eggs to bind all these ingredients together. Lastly, a pinch of salt to balance out the sweetness and a teaspoon of vanilla extract for that extra layer of flavor. Now that you've gathered all your ingredients, it's time to move on to the fun part, the baking process. Ready to bake? Follow these steps carefully. Our first step in the baking process is to preheat the oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. This ensures a consistent temperature throughout the baking process, giving your apple cake an even golden hue. While the oven is warming up, let's move on to the batter. Start by combining your dry ingredients, two cups of all-purpose flour, one and a half teaspoons of baking powder, half a teaspoon of baking soda, and a pinch of salt. Whisk these together until they're well mixed. In a separate bowl, beat together one cup of softened butter and two cups of sugar until they're creamy and well combined. This is where your patience comes into play. It's crucial to take your time to ensure your butter and sugar mix is light and fluffy. To this, add four eggs one at a time, beating well after each addition. Stir in two teaspoons of vanilla extract to give our cake that delightful aroma. Now it's time to combine our wet and dry ingredients. Add the flour mixture to the butter mixture in thirds alternating with half a cup of milk. Make sure to begin and end with the flour mixture. Stir until just combined, then fold in two cups of peeled and diced apples. With our batter ready, let's move on to the baking. Grease and flour a nine inch round cake pan. Pour your batter into the pan, spreading it evenly. Pop it into your preheated oven and bake for about 50 to 60 minutes or until a toothpick inserted into the center comes out clean. Remember, baking is as much an art as it is a science. Don't be disheartened if your first attempt doesn't turn out exactly as you'd hoped. Each iteration is a learning experience, and with time you'll master the nuances of baking. Great job! You're now one step closer to enjoying your homemade apple cake. Now that your apple cake is ready, it's time to serve and enjoy. For a sophisticated touch, consider serving your apple cakes slightly warm. The warmth brings out the natural sweetness of the apples, creating a dessert that is both comforting and decadent. A scoop of creamy vanilla ice cream or a dollop of whipped cream can add a delightful contrast, enhancing the flavors even further. Now let's say there's some cake left over. Don't worry, it won't go to waste. Proper storage can ensure your apple cake stays fresh for days. Simply allow the cake to cool completely, then cover it tightly with cling wrap or store in an airtight container. Refrigerate to prolong its freshness and enjoy a slice whenever you crave a sweet treat. Remember the joy of baking lies not just in the process, but also in savoring every last crumb. Congratulations, you've mastered the art of making the perfect apple cake at home. There you have it, a simple and delectable apple cake recipe. We began with gathering our fresh ingredients, moved on to mixing them in perfect harmony, then baked it to golden perfection. The final step was to serve it with love and store any leftovers appropriately. Now it's your turn to try this recipe at home and share your baking journey in the comments below. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned for more delicious recipes. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more culinary adventures.